Alright, hey everybody, I'm back. Uh, it's been a while since I made a video, but I've been a little busy. Working a lot last weekend, and this weekend actually. Uh, made a few hours of overtime, so I can't complain. Oh look, an Enderman down there under that tree. Two of them! Wow! And a zombie. He's Well, he was down here. Who knows where he went. Okay, anyway, as you can see, things have changed around here. They look a little bit different. That's because I've been trying out a new uh, texture pack that I saw Paul Soares Jr. using, and I, I follow him because he's awesome. And he did a review on this texture pack that's called Paper Cutout, and uh, it's supposed to look like paper cutouts. Everything. Uh, everything is so smooth and, and crisp, it's not even funny. Uh, I think it's a little higher resolution. I think it's a. Uh, I think this is a 32 by 32, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm up in the tree that I uh, actually there are six jungle trees here. I grew to make like a big tree house out of. We're playing on serenity here. Go down to the next level, and this is sort of just a little room here. I'm going to go down and give you a look at the different different stone and wood and everything else textures. All right, I got a great sword here. I didn't think I would like these bane of Arthur. Oh, that's a sharpness four. Four. I had a bane of arthropods. This thing, this one and that one apparently though they kill spiders like nothing else. But if you look, look how smooth this grass looks. I'll just be still here for a minute and let you see it. Even up close, it's just there's enough texture to tell where the edges of things are. It still looks like textured paper. Go down here, find some stone. Uh, that's sand. No, that's snow. I think that's snow. Nope, that's sand. <laughs> okay, and water. The water is apparently not animated unless it's moving like this over here. But this is stone. Very clean looking. Looks a lot like get out of the water. Okay. Looks a lot like clay. And this would be stone bricks and I'm not sure if that's I think that's jungle wood. But I look at let me look at the trees over here and see that may be jungle wood. It is. That's jungle wood. This this is the regular wood here. And uh interesting pattern when you put it up on a wall. <clears throat> the animals and mobs, a lot of mobs don't look much different. There are a few changes. See there's regular wood there with jungle wood here. These wooden stairs. Come here pig. He's creepy with those just black eyes with no nothing around them without the white spots. I uh, really like the the way the glass is fully transparent and the doors are nice. These leaves look like post-it notes stuck together. And yeah, that's outside. Now let's head back to the house. I'm gonna go downstairs. I'm just gonna do some warping around here. I'm not going to take all the time to run. I don't want to waste that time. But, we're looking at chests here, and music box, uh, the disc player, music disc player, lava, uh, iron fencing, and of course stone, crafting bench, crafting table, got nether fence, nether, nether brick fence, uh, this is mossy cobblestone here, and hmm, oh yeah, something I don't like very much. That's the hmm, dirt. Never really noticed that before. 
this is what furnaces look like and I'm not a big fan of what the furnaces look like uh, see they light up but I don't know something just doesn't look right about that <clears throat> let's see what else we can see here well I have some nether brick over here you can look at it's much brighter than I see these are nether brick here with nether brick stairs along the edge uh, there's your vines they look a lot like leaves that's gonna open okay alright here's nether brick which as you can see it's quite a bit lighter colored oh no I'm trapped in here oh it's this pressure plate <laughs> um, something about this I don't know what the deal is but there's something written on the bottoms of the chests here can't see what that is and I've gone over here looked at my enchanting table it's also got something written on the bottom but I can't tell what it is and that's uh, glowstone oh I forgot to show you uh, oh here down here we have gravel see Let's put that back because I don't want anything coming in here and blowing me up when I'm not here or waiting on me. Okay, let's go check out some skeletons. Go to skellies. Uh, that's cobblestone. Looks just like the mossy cobblestone, but with the mossy has green in there. And. I guess we'll wait on some skellies here. Let me eat something. Uh oh, that's not eating, that's blocking. There we go. Now then. We'll take a walk outside for a few minutes. And see if there's anything moving around out here. There's a lot of gravel over there. I thought there were there's some there. Uh dirt. What is this up here? Is this coal? I think this is coal. Yeah, that's coal. Uh, iron, diamond, other things. They look similar. Yeah, they don't look they don't look like ores when you first find them. You have to kind of get used to things. But most of it is 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 close enough that you'll know what it is. Like this smooth stone here. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's put another torch up here. I don't want things spawning. There's redstone over there, I think. Unless that's iron. Let's see what this is. Is that iron or redstone? That's iron. Here, let me put a torch up there so you can see it. That's what iron looks like. Oh man, one I can't reach. Let's see, can I get up here and reach it? Here we go. Yeah. And, hmm, coal. Nothing special about that. I'll put this here so I don't get things spawning. And, oh, I know, we'll knock down this. Oh, fall down. Yeah, I just thought I'd give a quick look of what this looks like since I'm going to be using it. Well, I don't know how much I'm going to use it, actually. I really like the normal default Minecraft texture pack. Every now and then I like, try, like to try something new, though. Um, I hear a zombie. I don't need zombies right now. Whoa, that's dark down there. Hmm. Well, 
Let's go look and see what's down there, just for the heck of it. It is dark. I see a zombie down there. I've explored all that. I haven't really explored over there, though, it looks like. And there is a zombie over there. Come on, buddy. Oh, there's lag tonight. Yikes! I didn't even notice earlier. Alright, I'm gonna put a torch. Yeah, I'm getting frame rate issues and everything tonight. Oh, there's some spider web. And looks like more iron. I'm not gonna get that. That's below. I'm gonna even stop exploring over here. I know why I didn't come down here now. That's this is underneath. I think that's Colton's uh, going farm up there. Iron going farm, so I gotta get out of here. I don't need to be in here. Okay. Oh, good grief, what is up with this frame rate thing tonight? Let me get inside where it's not. where it's kinda safe to be anyway. Any day now. Oh, really? This is just not going to work. Anyway, so I thought I might show you that. That is pretty much it because I'm getting just too much lag here tonight. Well, look, it's almost running full speed now, so I don't know what the deal is. Well, let's kill these guys anyway. Oh, and I wanted to show you that I really do only have two texture packs options video settings texture packs see I've got default paper cutout and nostalgia craft which is a lot like the normal minecraft texture pack just some of the, the it's kind of faithful to the original texture pack but with a few minor changes here and there for example, the stone is a lot more textured, but I think this is just a regular resolution. It's not like a high resolution pack or anything. Let's go back out here real quick. Maybe we can see something. I don't like this. This is green, and that's supposed to be ma uh, stone bricks, regular stone bricks. But, yeah, I haven't used this one more than just a little bit. Oh, no, you don't. Get me out of here. Yes, thank you. Yeah, I don't need to be around here when we're having frame rate issues. So I'm going to open the door and go inside. Really? Alright, I'm just going to go home. Goodbye, Skelly. So I try, I like to try different uh, texture packs, and I'm going back to the normal default one now because I actually like it more than anything else I've tried in a long time. Things either change too much, and you have a hard time figuring out what things are, or, yeah, I just, I'd rather stick with a plain old default pack. So, for now, I'm going to go ahead and let you go, and I will see you guys later. Bye.